Hello and welcome back everyone to the second Horde Night in Seven Days to Die. Um, we're going to be busy working on the space for most of today because there's a lot to get done. As you can see, I have concrete all the way around here, except on this wall. And I have got to get this concrete in before tonight because if not, they're just going to attack this wall instead of coming at the front like, like I want. Uh, plus, we need to get some more blade traps up. Um, we need to get... I've got all the stuff for the motorcycle uh, to build right here, so we got to get that built. And we'll be able to travel in style, at least, and speed. I have to get more concrete actually fired up, so I'm going to have to go out and get some more rocks here in a bit. We've got wiring to do. We've got just, just basically everything. We've got to get everything done here today so we're gonna get cracking on that as soon as possible right now I need to go and grab my rock buster so I can make this concrete and I'm gonna need stones and I'm gonna need sand but I can make sand from stones and I'm also gonna make a generator bank I think the four engines I have should be plenty to run the blade traps I have I need 10 more forged iron. No, I don't need 150. I need 50, because I'm going to build some more blade traps. I need 10 extra. Okay, let's get these placed. I want one here. But I'll, I, I want to get the... I need, I need to get the one by the door down first, because... Something these things are weird. Oh, so, oh wait, it can go there. I saw it. Come on, game. There we go. Right there. Okay. See that? What that's going to do is just going to prevent uh, dogs and uh, crawlers, technically. When if anything gets its legs crawled off, they'll crawl into that blade, and then the top one will stop things that are trying to be on the door at the same time as so they're getting hit from both blades. And then I'll have ones along the walls, so when they're hugging the walls to come around to the, the front, they're going to get chopped up by those. That was the idea of the first base, and it didn't work, so I'm hoping it's going to work here. To be continued, we'll see. But for now, we're going to ride out to some rocks, and we're going to get some work done on those. Skill points. Yeah, we're going to dump some skill points into... Minor 69 year in mother load, I think. Because I want to get as many rocks as possible out here. Put one in strength too, because I need to get that down to 7 so I can get uh, all my tool skills and my stamina uh, skill all the way up. Alright, that should be enough for now. Let's go get this concrete fired up. Okay. I'm gonna need a thousand sand. When that's done, I'll be able to fire the concrete up. Uh, okay, this is done. Get my blade traps fired up. I'm gonna need some more iron, actually, because I'm gonna need to make some relays. Might as well go ahead and get them crafted out now. Though I'm, I'm probably not going to need all of them tonight because I'm not going to have all the blade traps I'm going to have, but yeah, I might as well go ahead and get them laid down. Okay, that's the engine for the bike, and we'll take the basic battery here because it doesn't really matter what quality the battery is for vehicles. It kind of should be. I wonder if uh, in the future, like, the level 6 batteries will give us, like, 
really high powered vehicles or something, that'd be nice. Okay, let's see, there's that. Let's go ahead and get that crafting. Oh, I didn't pick up my mechanical parts. Thought I did. And I've got to pick up the wheels too. Oh, I'm all thumbs today. Yeah, okay, let's get right back up here and grab the wheels and the mechanical parts. And the wheels, yes, that's right. And get them both crafting. Okay, here's my generator bank. Should be safe there. Don't think, uh, even if a cop blows up at the front door, I don't think it's gonna get that. Plus, I don't think we're going to have any cops yet. Oh, yeah, my relays. I forgot to make my relays. But I'm going to go ahead and get this set up. Put the engines and the gasoline in the generator. Oops, wrong button. Make it 200. That should be plenty for these blade traps. I can find some more engines, which I'm pretty sure I will be able to soon. Motorcycle's about done. 10 seconds. I'm actually going to stop that and put my relays in. We're closed, asshole. Come back tonight. all wired up. Now I'm just going to wait for the blade trap to put on the back to cook and we'll be ready to go. I'm going to save that fuel on me because I need to fuel up the bike. It's done. Boom. Let's fuel her all the way up. Boom, we're done. Alright, let me pick up my bike and store it. And then we're probably going to get into some stuff here uh, in town. Though I don't know if it'll make the video because I might have to cut it for time. Plant these two trees as well. I'll just plant them over here on the side. I'm sure I'll regret it later. Alright, let's head into town. Get a drop while I was uh, on the way home here, so I might as well grab it. Um, we get a vegetable stew recipe. I'll take that. And a farm bundle. I don't think I need any of that. Oops. I keep doing that. Chrysanthemum seed? No. Go oh, fuck goldenrod seeds. Farm plus I'm fucking need either. I'll take the mushroom seed though. Joel, this is uh, everything we got from the mission. There's stuff in here I can sell. Wait a minute. I'm gonna need to open some spots here for uh, the uh, quest uh, rewards. Put stuff I'm not gonna sell back in there. All right, Joel, what do you got for me? Howdy, Survivor. Here you go, um, friend. Level well, 2 Iron Spear, Vitamins, Iron Pickaxe, Hunting Ice Schematic, and, of course, Molotovs. Goddamn asshole. i could take these two and sell them right back to him. Home sweet home. Okay, we're going to park the bike back here tonight, so in case things go really wrong... I could jump out of the window up the top of the escape hatch, get on the bike, and just ride. Alright, now let's get these other blade traps down. 
right there. And I'm actually gonna want one more. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that fired up now. This should be, I should get that done before uh, the horde comes. We still got plenty of time. That was the first lightning crash, so we still got time. So this one I'm gonna, I want it right directly in the center, because it might be where the... Okay, so if I come right through the edge, go over like three spaces, one, two, three, there. And then we'll put another one right next to it, and we should go. Uh, you're early, sir. What did I just tell you? We're fucking closed. Come back in an hour. Take hit. That blade trap should be done by now. Boom. That's most of the house completely concreted. And there we go. That should take care of anybody coming out from the back. Got about an hour till the horn. We're looking good. Okay, here we go. Now, if this all works correctly, this should be very uneventful, because the trap should do most of the work. Well, already got a dog. I'm glad I got the, the floor trap. More dogs. This is what I expected the first time. More dogs. I... Like a meat grinder. More dogs. Notice I didn't upgrade my uh, top plate here. I need to do that. And now it's still cobblestone. That uh, plate there is to prevent them from climbing through the opening. It's not 100% foolproof, but it is uh, very effective. Get some repairs on that trap. Bitch! I was out of stamina. That is one thing that really does suck about the, um... The Pipe Baton is it's... Pretty decent on a one-on-one -on -one basis, but when you have multiple guys like this, it's hard to hit multiples. At, actually, it's impossible to hit multiples. I would much prefer a baseball bat. There's a lot of dog bodies out there. They're actually starting to stand on them. And I put my knife away. Yeah, I can't get to the tra There we go. Couldn't get to the trap. I might have to get my knife and try to get these bodies out of the way. I got a lull. I should go get my knife. Not over, but one down, couple down, another one coming. 
Oh, here we go. Ow. Okay, I stabbed her in the face. More dogs. Wow, a lot of dogs tonight. Space. I don't know how she hit me there. She had, she attacked my arm like a doll scene. Shit, his head fell through off. That was funny. Man, it's a ton of dogs. Grinders in full effect. I'm trying to get some of these bodies out of the way, but there's too many pricks. Damn it, lady. There. Got some more steel here. I'm gonna go ahead and grab it. Doesn't take much steel to repair these, but uh no harm in being prepared. Now here's something that I had cooking up. So in case they do get frisky. Though, honestly, I expect it to be a disappointment. Because it is only at level 1. We have had a steady stream of dogs all night. There, buddy. Oh my god, I knocked her head completely off into the trap. I'd say I thought maybe we had a lull there, but no. It's just past one in the morning. Or excuse me, just past midnight. Dead. I'm willing to bet the bleed trap on my left here on the wall is going to need some major repairs. That door alone, bitch. They're slowing down for sure. Now, I, I guess the biggest question would be, how do I protect this base against demolishers? Uh, the answer is you don't. You, you, you protect no base from demolishers. Demolishers are designed to just end your game, which... 
I fucking hate to do something like this. It's a dumb idea. But we're gonna deal with it because we have to. Shouldn't see demolishers for a long time. I think that might be it. I'm not hearing anything. Yeah, that's gonna be it, I think. Get rid of this meat. Yeah, alright, let's turn these off. We'll get to looting. Checking uh, what we need to repair here. That's fully repair. This one's not bad. Yeah, see, I knew this one was going to need some. What I'm curious though is what about the back? How many hit the blades in the back? I'm going to need to get um, my concrete and uh, the metal to repair the door and the. Um, I don't need blocks. I'm sure a, a couple of those blocks got tagged. At least once. I'm gonna keep that steel on me because I'm gonna see if one in the back got damaged. Because if any of them got damaged in the back, that means that some of them were coming for the back. Oh, not sugar butts. I want I candy. Here we go. Let's loot these uh, loot bags first, though. Level 6 primitive bow. Get into that kind of thing. Some steel. Mm, food and ammo. 445 bucks, not bad. It's a level 2 iron helmet. Mm, ammo there, and an antibiotic. Or, excuse me, no, that was a vitamin. I'm dumb. The body turned blue. Uh, sledgehammer parts. Uh, nothing to really like write home about, but uh, ammo is ammo. I like it. Let's check these. No damage there. Slight damage here, so uh, it only got hit once. Fantastic. Everything's going to plan. All right, uh, that's going to be the end of the video, guys. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Um, you know what to do with YouTube and buttons and upvotes and likes and whatever. Um, this is a very successful horde. On the next video, we'll be moving up to warrior difficulty, and things are going to keep getting harder and harder. And We'll see if we can survive past day 50. Uh, thank you again. We'll see you next time.